All right, hi everyone, how you doing? Uh, thank you for coming onto the channel or onto this video. If you are a Genesis fan, that's probably why you're watching this video. Very few people watch my video videos because they're a Ryan fan. So anyways, I'm glad you're here. I'm glad you're watching another Genesis first time listen, reaction, however you want to call it. Uh, I appreciate all the passionate, informative comments regarding my Genesis videos and all my videos. I do my journey my way. I work with a lot of my Patreons. They, they, uh, this is what the Genesis journeys kind of turn into because there's a, a donation on Patreon where a fellow Matt, thank you, uh, has given me all the video suggestions and YouTube links and he's paid accordingly. So I'm going to go with that journey now. Uh, that's what I'm doing. But the point I'm trying to make is people are like, Ryan, you're doing it wrong. There's no wrong way of doing this. It's okay. I've had some people say, oh, Ryan, you listened to that song. We should have listened to the other one before because it goes into it. The beauty of it is, guys, I can always go back. If I enjoyed it by not listening to it properly, then guess what? I can still go back, listen to it properly, and enjoy it even more. It just won't be caught on camera. Uh, I didn't realize that listening to the Genesis songs... This is the problem... Okay, I'll tell you what. This is the problem with Genesis, Rush, Pink Floyd. And I personally am enjoying Genesis the most on a personal journey. I will be honest with you. But I really dislike it when commenters say... Like, you're listening to it wrong, or you're doing it the wrong order. It's like, dude, I'm listening to a song. At the end of the day, it's a song. Relax. It's not a religion. You know, I know some of you are very passionate about that, and that's fine. But the point is, I'm still enjoying it. <laughs> I don't understand. Like, it, like you're saying, Ryan, you're not enjoying it properly. Well, that's your that's your opinion. That's fine. And I know you're, you're passionate about your opinion, but I, I, don't, I don't require people to worry about my enjoyment if that makes sense so i'm just saying relax everybody have a good time i'm doing the best i can with people that are, are sending me links and if i'm even interpreting the links wrong matt i'm sorry if i didn't do the studio version first or whatever i'm just doing what feels at the moment and what i want to do okay uh but i do appreciate the passion and i understand the passion trust me there's bands and artists and actors and actresses that i'm very passionate about but at the end of the day it's just art it's music and we're all enjoying it Okay, and I got that out of the way. Uh, the song that we're going to do today is Inside and Out. And, uh, what's wrong one? I'm going to listen to the live version, Matt. Okay, this is, I'm speaking to you. Because it is, it's not, uh, the reason why I like live, but I like live with video. Like, actual, like, the pro shot version of them moving around. I like seeing Phil Collins or whoever's their antics. Like, that's what I loved about the Peter Gabriel live songs. I enjoyed them more live, not because the music was better live necessarily but because i like watching the band interact and watching their movements and the costumes the design whatever it is i love live performances so the the video you sent me doesn't have that it's just a live performance so we're going to listen to the live performance but i'm going to bring up the lyrics at the same time on my itunes okay that's the compromise on this one all right here we go genesis inside and out live but it's no video it's just audio Oh, 
Wow, that was an incredible ending. Let's hear some Phil banter, probably. Merci. Thank you. Bienvenue, welcome, say hello to Mr. Steve Hackett. Last tour, I think, with Steve. Hello, everybody. How you doing, Zurich? Okay? Nice to see you again. We don't come that often, do we? Anyway, we're going to do a, an older number now. From the days when we were selling them by the pound. Yeah. Very nice of you, thank you. Well, according to the track list, it's going to be Firth of Fifth. This one's a little song about river. It's called Firth of Fifth. Great song, yes, we all know. Uh, but uh, anyways, okay, so uh, that was uh, inside and out. Uh, uh, <laughs> Sorry, Matt said that it had a slow beginning, but it wasn't a bad beginning. It was, yeah, but it was slow, and he he did uh, tell me that there's a pickup, but uh, I loved it anyways. I loved the slow beginning. I thought it was really nice lyrics, the story there between the cop and the brother and everything like that, and uh, and then that yeah that ending jam was awesome, awesome. And yeah, it's kind of sad. This is Steve Hackett's last hurrah uh, with the band. So, all right. Thanks, everyone. Thanks for watching. I appreciate you joining me on my Genesis journey. More to come.